1862, there was a wagon shop, one blacksmith, two blacksmiths, three blacksmiths, four blacksmiths in the village. So, two months ago, this was just a pipe dream, and a lot of people helped me to get the equip, give me iron and coal, and I made it work. And it's a fun thing, it's not every I added some wood on top, there's absolutely no smoke, and it's working. My man cave. Let's put some light in there. There we go. Very good. No snow. Okay, this is at the stage I'm now. Um, ben gave me this uh, drill press. very good I uh, installed this vise and I got a piece of metal to hit on I got uh, drill bits most of them are not good anymore uh, miscellaneous cans okay um, this is warm not today because it's not sunny but in a nice day uh, you don't need a jacket in here. It's like a sunroom. And this thing, this thing I bought in 1999, it broke one year after because the table was put pulled off, took all the weight and snap those angle thing. The rubber was off. I put the tape instead. Trying something here. Wrap this around that to create something like that here it is not pretty but it's strong and i don't need to incline the table at this point if i just can have it sitting down properly on the rack here at least i will have a table that is flat and level in a way so i'm gonna try this trick first and see what happens Okay, so this is all broken. I cannot use that inside and wrap it up as I did this one. So I create this one. Let's see. I replace by this. And the other one is there. Table is pretty steady. And well, <laughs> it's the first test. Okay. Yeah, this little noise, the blade is uh, tapping inside here not so while. Anyway, let's see if the blade will fall off.
that's going to be a good help to make new handles. Okay, this is my uh, buffer. And a grinder. Okay, let's switch on the other side. So now there's two buildings, but when those doors open, it becomes one building. So let's see on this side what we have. A little bit. Okay, it'll take no time. This place will be warm. There, the made anvil, three inches plate. And this is the guillotine. Basically, I put something in there, smack on this, and make a little groove in the middle. And a beak, a beak. And all the tools I made so far, I made all those ones. The tongs and the fire run by. This is for ventilation, one computer fan. And there's two more of the same to run the fire on the side there, run by computer fan. Yeah, the noise in the beginning, and after one minute, become pretty quiet. And some storage, all kind of crap, and hammers, my wood and horseshoe then let's shut this off there we go and this is the forge part as i said when i put for example when I open the two doors and open that door became a long building. So I can be outside and good uh, ventilation. Dream come true. Yes, it's in Gaelic. Okay. That's what you look from the outside. Those are the lines the landscape here and the building itself go back go back here we go and this is where I make the charcoal This is my pile of wood that I use for the uh, house and the uh, forge. maple that was knocked down last year from the storm Fiona 
Let's do it. Let's put the fan on. Got my tea. Let's go back. Still my tea. Okay, I took a pile of rusty nail and bolt and I cleaned them this morning. So this is the result. And now from this, there's some keeper that I want to put aside for some other project. And I'm gonna, oh, this is a nice one. Okay, this is stuff that I found on the ground. Uh, that I kept, I cleaned them up. Some make nice punch. Actually, this one is a punch. I never shaped this one, it's just as it is. And some are just pins. I don't know what the was used for. So, this is the stuff I'm gonna work with this morning to try to make some oak. Those I keep, and those are not done yet. Okay, let's get to work. I got to finish those today. And start a new one. There we go.
Whoops. Whoops. It's a bit too hot. Okay. Very good. That's what I'm going for. was my previous project. Hinges. So I thought it'd be maybe a um, handle on the chest to pull the chest up or maybe on some door but I just have two and I want to keep it to show people. I don't want to install them. <laughs> okay, having fun. Okay, the handle became this and you see the thread a little bit here, the other thread here. Okay, spike, flat down, that's the head, became this. And square bar, roll this way became that. I still have to make the holes and they'll be finished. Okay, this is what I use in the forge. Broken spike, short spike, big spike, bolt found in the ground. And this is what I make with it. Then there's also a smaller one. So this was a spike before. And those are the fell of the week. I was try, try to make a cross, uh, but it's wrought iron. So it's um, a lot of fibers into it. And when you're almost done, sometimes you delaminate like this. This one, I lost one prong, I was not finished. And this one, I twist too much and it snap. Same thing for this one. And same thing for this one. It's almost good, but it's broken. from raw material found in the ground. All those things were made. And even pliers. Okay, that's another pair of pliers that can I finish tomorrow. Okay. So, two months ago, this was just a pipe dream, and a lot of people helped me to get the equipped. Give me iron and coal 
and I made it work and it's a fun thing it's not every day but this was trash and this became this so next time you find trash on the ground and if you don't need it, give it to me. And those are striker. Do they work? I do not know. And this is a railroad spike. And it goes in the wall up to here and that's the hook and I try different finial different variation at the end uh, this was a big bolt I flat down the bolt you can see this even and that became this and this is all wrought iron and wrought iron is tough because the tip always fall apart the more you try to do something with it, it delaminate. And I'm trying to get around it, try to find tricks. And I think I'm getting there. Okay. So simple.
Yes, you notice it's pretty quiet, but uh, usually the radio is on all the time. But when I do a YouTube video, I shut it off to avoid a copyright uh, claim on the video after. All down from a spike to a hook. What is this? This is the blower for the forge. It contains two computer fans. The heat doesn't travel up to here. This is black iron, this is a black nipple, this is a cone I made, the vial duct tape, and I put the one fan here and one fan here and my uh, chicken wire to make sure that nothing falls into the 
burning wood and you want to see what temperature I can go with wood, I will activate two computer fan. Very hot. This is welding temperature. If I leave the piece of metal there too long, it will simply fall apart. The, near the wind. And this is run by two computer fan, normal fan, the inside there. And there's another small one here for evacuation too. And this is, yeah. Okay. Okay, let's shut the fan. Okay. One fan. And now two fans. Now it's a normal um, summer camp fire. Dream come true. And thank you again for the people who helped me out to, to uh, equip this forge. And thank you also for the recycle iron uh, ridges. And to my friend, if you find uh, some trash iron, uh, I can use that to make more oaks and uh, stuff like that.